Good deeds happen every day and rarely get noticed, but the folks at Caprock High want to make sure their former students are getting reward for their positive contributions to the community. I spent the day on the campus to learn what goes into choosing their distinguished alumni. Take a walk around the campus of Caprock High. You'll notice the halls are full of Longhorn pride, and that is a very important factor to be considered as a distinguished alumni. It recognizes past graduates for something that they've done wonderful in our community, and um, we just hold it a great honor here. To be eligible, former students must be at least 10 years out of high school and show that they have made some sort of difference in the community. But that's not all. Are you orange enough? That's the question the Distinguished Alumni Committee asks when making their decision. If you are, you get to take home a cool plaque like this, and your photo gets placed on this wall right here. With the Distinguished Alumni, we want them to know that, yes, that we believe that you still are orange enough and that you represent our community and our school to the best of their ability. Past honorees have been doctors, lawyers, and commissioners. Mercy Morgia was inducted into the Distinguished Alumni Wall during the school's 50th anniversary and says she still can't believe she was chosen. There was a lot of awareness around what the school had done in the last 50 years and, and what really brought Caprock to the Amarillo area um, and what are some of the challenges and some of the prosperities of that growth. So I thought it was very much an honor to be inducted and, and in the 50th celebration. Morgia says winning this award motivates her to be a leader in her community and she hopes this will encourage other alumni to follow the same steps and celebrate their alma mater. We have had some significant leaders from an alumni perspective and, and we really wanted to use the 50th year to start to encourage the alumni um, of all walks of life to come in and help celebrate the schools. And as for future hopeful honorees? I challenge whoever's watching that to really think about who are those unsung heroes that deserve to be in this distinguished alumni and help us really reach out to them.